the looseness of it is kind of what makes it friendly, but there are problems with that, especially when it interfaces with other stuff. And, you know, again, the, the idea of it being a little slower and it, that all depends on what you're trying to do. But again, that's some of the reasons that we really love it. They're not common anymore, but there are languages out there that don't use zero indexing. They use one indexing. Uh, it makes a lot more sense. We don't start counting at zero. The reason we do is a historic reason that has to do with how C handles things and arrays in addition. But one of the reasons that hasn't didn't take off is because there were enough languages out there that were zeros that it actually caused more confusion because now you're like, which kind of language am I in? And yeah, I'm going to swap back and forth. One base, yeah. So, so like, like yeah. Python being a friendlier language, I could sort of see them having gone Choosing down that, that yeah, path yeah. because it's the easier to understand thing. But the flip side of it is then it makes it harder to interact with C underneath, which Python does really well. And so they're basic concepts that the language designers make and have long-term implications. 